have peace and rest. We have the peace of God that must envelop your mind. Come on. Avoid chaos, battles, and war. Because when peace arrives, war disappears. The seat of war cannot mingle with the seat of peace. That's why we call Jesus the Prince of Peace. So it is the Prince of Peace to sit on you just to guide your mind. Because depression, frustration, anxiety can just crash up. Just overnight, just a second, just a minute, just an hour, you can go crazy. When you go crazy, decision making, choice making are inevitable. You can decide and take decision and make choice anyhow. There are some things that you see as right. But it's wrong. All because you don't have peace. That's something that you see as just. But it's unjust. Because you don't have peace. When there's no peace in your mind, you don't have the ability to attest good from bad. Wrong from right. Just from unjust. You follow any sign, any sound. Anyways, many people are condemned because they don't have peace in their mind. When there's no peace, it's difficult to live and accept moral values. And you see it as normal. When there's no peace in your mind, when you are confused, these are some of the things that you do it unconsciously. And when it becomes part of you, it will damage your future. So it takes the peace of mind to purge your mind to understand moral values. 